And welcome back, guys. Uh, you're watching uh, my FTL Let's Play, and uh, as always, this is Gord. And uh, yeah, so FTL, great game, guys. Uh, if you're watching the last episode, we uh, crossed this sector, m you know, hitting a few planets along the way. Um, chased a ship away out into the next sector, which we're going to take care of hopefully this episode and uh, picked up a lot of resources along the way, all on our quest to bring vital data to the Federation. So, <laughs> uh, without further ado, I'm going to start this episode off by um, jumping to the next sector. I'm sure you guys have been itching to see what awaits. So, uh, let's check it out. Now, we have uh, two branch options for this next sector, um, both of which are civilian. Um, and both of which are apparently Zoltan controlled. So it really, I don't see a difference. So I don't know. I'm pick the bottom one. Why not? Also, in the last episode, we picked up a third crew member. So that's now we have somebody manning our um, uh, weapons again. So that's always a plus. Okay, so let's uh, let's take a look. What we got here. Uh, as you can see over here, we have that quest marker. Um, that would be the ship we chased into this sector. Uh, down here, we have a distress marker. Um, let's go ahead and hit that up first. Let's see what we have. It appears the distress beacon is coming from the surface of a nearby moon. Your sensors are picking up a single life form. Let's go down to the surface and investigate. You find a colony that seems to have been recently attacked. Exploring the devastation, you find a lone survivor. Uh, let's invite him to join the crew. He happily offers his service for a time in exchange for getting off that rock. Sounds cool. So what do we get here? We got a... Uh, let's take a look at our crew too. We, ha we haven't had a chance to do that. Scoops, our latest Mantis crew member. Apparently he does double damage in combat, so he's good if I want to have people... Uh, I wanna, if I have board, people boarding my ship and I want uh, them taken out, he's good at that. Also, he moves faster, but he repairs much slower, so I'm not going to be sending him out for repairs. Let's see, our latest crew member, Charlie, he's a rock man, and says, The rock man of Vraknos IV are rarely seen and are known for their fortitude. He's immune to fire, so he's going to be our primary firefighter. Uh, his movement speed is halved but his health has increased to 150 instead of the average 100, I believe is the average. So that's cool, we got, we got, a, we got a firefighter and he's also gonna be our engine specialist. We're gonna get him to man the engines. So now we will uh, have increased evasion rate. Right now our evasion is 20. Let's see what it goes up to once we get him in there. Come on, buddy. And now it's up to 25. Nice. Okay, so we got an extra crew member. Yay! Alright, so let's see what's next. Where are we going to jump to? Let's let's do kind of like a zigzag pattern across. You jump into a debris field that used to be a Zoltan cruiser. Unfortunately, its NG escort takes you for the attacker and retaliates. They refuse all hails. So unfortunately, because they just, they're just they too stupid to listen, uh, they're going to be just annihilated. Now, looking at their defenses real quick, they have a defense drone, so uh, sh missiles uh, won't be getting through. So uh, I'm going to be using lasers mainly for this. So let's get our lasers charged up, and uh, let's focus. Let's see what they have for weapons. Looks like they have a beam weapon and a laser weapon. So I want to... I want to take out their shields first, I suppose. And then once their shields are done with that weapon, I'll hit them with the heavy laser on their weapon systems. Ah, damn it, they got just a little bit of shield up before that got through. That's okay, though. Oh, wait, that wasn't even their shields. Pfft, wow. New mistake. This is their shields up here. Let's take out their shields. All right. So their shields down. Now let's hit their weapons with this heavy laser. Oh, heavy laser missed. It's targeted again, as well as their shields. Okay. Uh, the heavy laser, since it's a single shot, I really want to use it after their shields are already down. So, I've gotta be prepared for that. 
Alright, but there we go. Annihilated them. They're toast. So, their ship explodes, leaving behind scrap. So, we got one fuel, one missile, and 34 scrap. It's a nice little bounty we got. Okay, so all our ship systems are good. All our people are fairly in good condition. Let's m quickly move out to the next area. What do we have here? You pick up the last broadcast from a rupturing Zoltan f uh, freighter. The Mantis, they're here, please! You're interrupted by fire off the port bow. Okay, so everyone man your stations. Uh, we'll target their, target their shields. And uh, we'll get their shields taken out. Oh, intruders detected. Okay, so they have uh, one of these dudes, um, and which do extra damage. So I want to send this guy. Let's see who's good at fighting. Uh, right now, the only person with any experience in fighting is this guy. So since they're heading towards Maria anyway, I'm going to send Maria after them. Send these two guys after them and see how they fare. Uh, also, uh, let's make sure to keep up the assault while. Ooh, shit! All right, that that hurt the people in that area, and it also caused a little bit of a hull rupture, rupture there. So let's let's send these guys to med. Ooh, shit! Barely survived that one. Okay. Oh, Maria, I almost lost you there. All right, so let's get these guys healed up. Uh, good thing we got the salt breach. It's gonna also damage the guys in here. So hey. Uh, now that we got these guys' shields down, let's take out their weapons. Oh, and look at that, we caused some fire, we uh, damaged their weapons somewhat. That's always cool. Nice, their rocket missed. Let's, um... Let's target their weapons some more, and now we have Scoops back up. Let's send him back in here to, to start fighting these guys. And Maria's getting good enough, we'll send her in there to finish fighting those guys. And hopefully between the two of them, we can fend off these intruders. These guys are starting to get low, but I think they'll get them. Right there. All right, yeah, okay, so we got them. We got them taken care of. Cool beans. And these guys are toast. Uh, I'm just going <laughs> to finish them off, actually. Put them out of their misery. There we go. Bye bye, Mantis fri fri Fighter. The ship explodes, blah blah blah, scrap. So we got one fuel, one missile, 32 scrap. Not a bad collection there. Alright, so we'll, we'll, what do we got here? Let's, um, these two guys are healed up. Let's send them in to repair this. Shay, which guy, hold on, I'm gonna quickly look. Which guy was good with repair? Oh, this guy was bad with repair, so I'm not gonna... I'm actually gonna... I don't want him getting any experience in repair. I'm gonna send him back to... Or I'm gonna send him back to Med Bay to heal up. And I'll just... I'll keep Marie on this. She knows what she's doing. And, uh... Let's get her into Med Bay, too. And then Scoops is fully healed back up. Let's get him back to his post. And, uh get Maria fully healed up and put her back to her post. Alrighty. Alright, so we survived that. Uh, nothing's too damaged. All our guys are healed back up, so let's make the next jump. Uh, let's take care of this quest. We chase this guy all the way into a new sector. Let's finish him off. You catch up with the Manda ship that escaped before, only to see them transferring their crew to an even bigger ship Oh no! <laughs> All right, now briefly looking at the ship. Ooh, it's not good. They have a teleporter, which means they're going to be sending these two guys in right off the bat. It looks like. Um, also, their ship has two shields, so they're an even match for me. Um, so we're going to be hitting them with everything we got. Not you again. Do you know how much these repairs are going to cost me? Time to take out the big guns. Not the big guns. All right, so let's um. Oh jeez. Let us... There's a missile on their weapon systems and then everything else we have on their shields. So once that's charged up, that will, that will fight. But they're going to be sending guys over. Yep, they sent some guys over. 
let's um let us let's send three dudes in here. Um, send everybody in here at once. Uh, slow rock man, Charlie. Now actually, what I'm going to do is I'm going to send these guys into the med bay, and then I'm going to open the med bay doors. So now our intruders have access to the med bay. So hopefully they should send cha give chase, and yes, they did. So now, if you can if you can ever bring a fight into the med bay, that's your best option because my dudes are being healed up as they're fighting. They're not going to have any difficulties. In fact, they're going to have so few difficulties. I'm going to let Maria go back into her post there. Um, these guys have taken them out. Beautiful. Um, let's see. And some of our things have been recharged. Let's, um, let's hit these guys again. Actually, I'm going to hold off on that until this is... There we go. Hit their shields. Once their shields are down, they appear be... Okay, so if we want to chase them down, we only got one shot at this. We got a uh, heavy laser. Alright, nice. Look, you proved your point. We don't want to die. Take this and let us go, please. Okay, so we can let them live, and we'll get 47 scrap and a weapon. Hmm. I, I can't guarantee this, guys, but I'm going to take the chance that we'll still get the weapon if we kill them. So let's finish them off and see if we still get an equal or greater reward. No, hurry up. Get us out of here. They're crazy. You cut transmissions. Okay, so they're, <laughs> they're not going anywhere. Um, let's, let's get you back to your post as well as you back to your post. Hopefully the Rockman can repair all that stuff. Uh, good old Charlie. And... Uh, let our weapons reactivate here. Let's hit these guys with everything else we got. Beautiful. Okay, so uh, the ship breaks apart, you salvage the two ships. We got two missiles, one drone part, 34 scrap, and a heavy ion. Now, that's Probably not as good a reward as we could have gotten. So I took a chance, and you know, we didn't get exactly what we wanted, but a heavy ion is, is not bad. Let's take a look at it real quick. It's um, it's just an ion weapon. It can disable systems without causing damage to the hull. Not a big reason we want to do that. Well, I mean, we could continuously damage their oxygen systems to kill the crew. So that that's always an idea if we want to keep ships intact and salvage more scrap from them. Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see. Let's um let us I'm gonna hold off just a bit. And then the next thing I'm gonna buy is further increasing my shields. Okay, you got that fixed. Uh well you got the um okay, let's get you out of here because you're going to die from the lack of oxygen. Let's get you back to med bay, get you all healed up, and in the meantime, I'll send Maria down to uh, finish repairing the engines just so we can get this stuff done and over with and jump to the next sector, or the next area. Alright, so she's got that repaired, sent her back to her post, he's all healed up, sent him back to his post, and once he's back there, that slow, slow dude, we will uh, jump to the next area. Alright, let's, hmm, I think I might go around like this, I don't know, let's, let's, uh, let's go down this way. Ooh, an asteroid belt. You arrive in an asteroid field and are greeted by a Zoltan guard. By attempting to access these closed mining fields, you are in violation of the Natural Mining Pro or Mineral Protection Act. Your weaponry will be confiscated for processing. And we don't have time for this, so let's continue and prepare to defend ourselves. Now looking at their ship real quick, um, looks like they have some sort of missile launcher as well as some sort of laser. 
So we probably want to get rid of their um, their weapons, but at the same time they do have an extra bar of shields. So this this bar right here has to be taken out uh, before we can actually damage their shields. Um, so what we're gonna have to do here. Now mind you, the asteroids are gonna help with that. I didn't even think of that till just now. Right, let's see what we got here. Let's um. Let's use some burst fire lasers on their shields. Wow, by the time this charge is up, I might actually even be able to just take it out. Alright, and their missiles are just missing left, right, and center. I guess that's why they call them missiles. Ha <laughs> ha! Uh, go ahead and slap your knees, guys, because that, that was a knee slapper. So, okay, we beat them. Uh, didn't, shouldn't come as a surprise. We are awesome. Uh, so, the ship explodes, yada yada. We got three fuel, one drone part, and almost 40 scrap. So that's cool. Now, we're still being hit or, uh, barraged by asteroids, so we want to get out of here. But other than that, all our ship systems and all our crew are fine right now, so let's jump to the next area. Let's jump up this way and see if we can hit some of the stars around the top of the map. You receive a message. This area is off limits. Submit your ship to processing. It is, it is on, or it's only one guard ship in a lonely beacon. You decide to fight your way out. I guess we we decided to fight our way out. All right, let's um, very. I think it's same ships last time pretty much um, but this time I want to try something different let's um, let's oh, all right, let's let's go with the heavy ion and the burst laser so let's first let's take out their shields if we can ooh that hurt okay so we lost some sensors there I'm gonna send Maria in to repair that uh, which we're gonna lose a buff to our shields momentarily but I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. Let's get our sensors back online. Oh, buddy. Okay, they're they're taking we're taking some hits. So what I want to do is I want to let's uh, temporarily deactivate their. Um, oh, miss! Damn it! All right. Um, let's continue hitting their shields. Oh darn! Oh right, yeah, I forgot to close this door in this door. It's uh, med bay is not too important right now. It's, um, okay, let's disable their weapons first. Ah, oh, damn it! Okay, maybe this approach isn't doing so well. This ship it has missiles and whatnot. I'll uh, I'll give you guys an example of uh, killing crew members later on. Uh, right now I'm taking far too much missile damage, so that's not something I want to deal with right now. Uh, now, Maria, let's send you to go fix the oxygen before everyone suffocates. Uh, let's get the burst laser going again. Alright, actually, if we hit this real quick, we might be able to... Oh! If that guy dies... Which he might. Um, hmm. There's actually no real way to kill him easily. Hmm. Let's, um. No, he's. Yeah. I wanted to try and kill off the crew members in the enemy ship, but it's not an easy feat. So let's, let's forget about that. Let's just finish these guys off. Put them out of their misery. All right, so we got uh, we got some scrap, we got some fuel, we got some missiles, all that good stuff. Um, let's uh, repair some of the damage here. All right, Maria, you get into the med bay there, and also Bars, you get into the you get into the med bay there too. Help her out. As long as we can get the med bay back online before they start dying, we should be good. Getting close, getting close, getting close, getting close, getting close. And they're good. Okay, so they're going to continue to heal up. That's good. 
How's everyone else doing? Charlie's a little low, but well, he's still pretty good, so we'll leave him. So let's get bars back up to the control. Marie, let's get you back to shields. And let's do some upgrading. I uh, have enough to upgrade my shields twice and upgrade my power twice, so let's do that. Also, while I'm at it, I might as well upgrade my piloting, which will uh, increase my evasion. Let's do that. As you can see right now, my evade is 27%. Uh, apparently, it's still 27%. Okay, maybe that got it. Right, whatever. I'm sure it went up, and I just maybe I should have counted it beforehand. Anyway. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see. So now let's put power into shields. Now we have three shield slot. That uh, that will, that will do us pretty well. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna call. Uh, that's gonna be it for this episode. We've run about 20 minutes, and uh, we'll explore the rest of this sector in the uh, next episode. So uh, thanks for watching. Uh, if you like this video, give it a like. If you love it, give it a favorite. And uh, if you want to see more, subscribe. Uh, this has been Gord, and thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy.